Many of us don't think about cleaning out the washing machine. I mean, it's supposed to clean our clothes, so how dirty can it get? Even though you constantly run soap through your washing machine, that does not mean it cleans itself. If you wash your clothes in a machine that smells, it's possible for the odor to transfer to the fabrics. Over time, washing machines get dirty soap scum builds up, leaving you with a washer that's in serious need of a refresh. Learning how to clean a washing machine is essential for keeping smells, mold and grime at bay. If you've ever wondered why your washing machine smelled funny or if you should be cleaning it, you need to clean it. If you haven't ever wondered about cleaning this hard-working appliance, you still need to clean it. In this video, we have brought it for you all, the easiest methods to clean your washing machines naturally. But before we move forward, if you like our videos and content and don't want to miss out on any of them, hit the like, subscribe and bell icon. You can clean a top-loading or front-loading washing machine with white vinegar or bleach. The preference is to use either white vinegar or non-chlorinated bleach because they are safe. All natural solutions, but some washing machine manufacturers recommend only using chlorinated bleach. Most importantly, follow the instructions for a specific machine or try one of these natural methods. Cleaning your top-loading washing machine is simple. All you need is white vinegar and some cleaning cloths. Worried that your laundry will smell like a pickle? Once the rinse cycle runs, you won't smell the vinegar. You can start by setting your washer to its hottest temperature, highest capacity and longest cycle. Add 4 cups of chlorinated bleach to the hot water. Close the lid and allow it to agitate for several minutes. Open the lid or pause the machine and allow it to sit for an hour so that the vinegar can do its job and get rid of bacteria, mold and mildew and those hoses of your machine. After you have run a complete cycle with the vinegar solution, you can repeat the process if your washing machine is extra dirty. The vinegar does a great job of removing any buildup, not to mention softening any soap scum and other residue that may be in the washer and hoses. Let your machine agitate the solution for several minutes and open the lid. While you allow this solution to sit for an hour, it's time to tackle the exterior of the washer as well as the fabric softener and bleach reservoirs. Using a clean rag or microfiber cloth, dip it in the vinegar solution and rig it out. Wipe down the exterior, lid and control panel, taking care not to get it too wet. Remove the bleach reservoir and wipe around the area where scum and dirt tends to collect. Rinse your cloth and remove the softener reservoir from the machine and wipe the exterior and interior of it as well. Close the lid and allow the washer to complete its cycle. Front-loading washing machines are relatively new on the home appliance market and have quickly gained popularity for their efficiency and cleaning abilities. Despite all the benefits they have to offer, there is one common complaint that seems to plague owners. Stinky laundry. Wiping down the interior of the washer with cleaner, using extra detergent or running everything on the longest, hottest cycle does nothing to help dissipate the scent. However, one simple cleaning task will not only eliminate the issue, it will keep your washer in tip-top condition. These washing machines use less water and less energy, which in turn can result in more mildew, mold, detergent residue and build up in your washer. Select the hot water setting. If your machine does not have a hot water setting, then select a white cycle setting. Select the extra rinse option if your washer has the choice. Add 3 quarter cups of non-chlorinated bleach to the bleach dispenser or fill it to its max level. Allow the cycle to run until it has completed. To ensure that no vinegar remains in your washer, Manually select an additional rinse cycle if your washer does not have a second rinse cycle selection. After that you have finished washing the interior of the washer. Take a couple of minutes to clean the bleach and fabric softener dispensers. These can be easily cleaned by simply removing and washing in warm, soapy water to remove any residue or by wiping them down with white vinegar on a cleaning cloth. Rinse and dry them thoroughly before reinserting them. After cleaning, you can wipe down the exterior and control panel with a gentle all-purpose cleaning spray to remove any dust and dirt buildup. Maintaining a clean washer and eliminating the stinky laundry issue is simple. Be sure to leave the door open to prevent moisture buildup in between loads and clean it inside and out every month. While chemical cleaning solutions could damage your machine, you can easily make your own cleaning solution with natural ingredients like white vinegar, bleach and baking soda. This natural cleaning solution can help get rid of mildew, grime and built up soap scum. Whether you have a top load or front loading machine, you can keep your machine clean and smelling great. You can take advantage of some bonus tips as well. To keep your washing machine regularly clean, wipe out the rubber seal of your washing machine regularly and continue to deep clean once every 6 months. If your washing machine has a lint filter, make sure to clean it regularly as well. 
Leave the lid up or the dough open immediately after a wash cycle to give it a chance to dry out and prevent mildew from forming. Always heed your appliance's instructions for how much detergent to use. Exceeding the recommended amount can leave your clothes with a soapy residue and cause unnecessary wear to your machine. Never overload the washing machine. Overloading a machine is hard on it and can cause it to wear down more quickly. The best and home remedy cleaners that can be used to clean out your washing machines are washing soda, vinegar, borax and certain essential oils. Washing soda is fabulous for cleaning different surfaces around the house. This amplified version of baking soda helps to break down hard water deposits, dissolve grease and deodorize. Vinegar is an acid that helps tame mineral deposits, grease, mold and mildew. It can be regularly used on the rinse cycle as a fabric softener, but it's also effective at cleaning out the washing machine. Borax is a naturally occurring mineral that is known to kill a wide variety of mold and soften water. Essential oils have a wide range of antimicrobial properties, depending on which ones are used. Tea tree or melaleuca is a potent antifungal to help with mold growth. Thieves blend helps to fight bacteria and viruses. These are optional, but really help to boost the disinfecting power. Cleaning a washing machine is not just a nice extra either. It's essential for keeping your washing machine working properly and safe for your health. Washing machines do accumulate bacteria over time, so it's important to clean yours regularly. Never leave your clothes sitting inside the machine for a prolonged period once finished washing. And be diligent in wiping down the inside and outside of the machine regularly to prevent mold, mildew and that smell we all loathe. If you've ever caught a whiff of rotten eggs or sulfur while transferring your laundry to your dryer, we've got some news. Your dirty washing machine is to blame. Even though you rely on your washer to clean towels, clothes and linens, it also needs to be cleaned from time to time, so that it can do its job well. It's not just about odor. Leftover laundry detergent, fabric softener and debris stuck in the wash tub can rub off on the clothes, leaving behind weird marks and stains. For these reasons alone, you should be cleaning your washing machine once a month, especially if you want to prevent musty odors and keep your clothes in tip-top shape. We hope that this video helps you out in getting your washing machines clean and clear, and thus your washed clothes are free of stains and smell. Subscribe to the channel and stay tuned with us till we get back to you all with yet another amazing video of the wonderful facts leading a step to a healthier, easier and beautiful life. Thank you.